Excavators located a, a cave about nine meters under the surface. Digging was stopped amid concerns the cave may collapse or be booby-trapped. The treasure hunters hope they will find traces of the amber room stolen by the Nazis from Russia during the Second World War. Well, the room once said to be the eighth wonder of the world was the source of many stories and legends. Adina Galushka has a story. Its beauty can only be compared to its phenomenal history. But what you're seeing here is only a copy of the original, carefully reconstructed over a quarter of a century by Russian craftsmen. The original Amber Room was built in 1701. It was installed in the Charlottesburg Palace, where Russian Tsar Peter the Great saw it for the first time and instantly fell in love with it. The room was later given to the Tsar by the Prussian king as a sign of allegiance. For almost 40 years, the room was disassembled and packed in crates. Then in 1755, Tsaritsa Elizabeth, known for her love for all things beautiful, ordered the room unpacked and assembled in her palace. Over the years, the chamber was decorated with a total of eight tons of amber, backed with gold leaf. It took almost ten years to complete the 50 square meter room. 300 years later, during the German invasion of Russia in 1941, the curators of the Catherine Palace attempted to remove the room, but it had become brittle and started breaking. They then tried to hide the room by covering it with wallpaper, but it took the German soldiers only 36 hours to find it and take the room apart. The crates containing the amber panels were transferred to the city of Königsberg, which is now Kaliningrad. Leonid Einstein served in the Soviet army. He was on a reconnaissance mission at the Königsberg Royal Palace when he encountered a German soldier who said he knew where the room was stored. I spoke German, but of course I wasn't fluent. I heard him say, Bernstein Zimmer. This means amber room in German. I understood the word and I got excited. I examined the amber panels lying on the floor and asked him, where is the rest of it? He got excited and started explaining to me he was using sign language. It's down there, in crates in the basement. Leonid wanted to return for the room the next day, but the fighting grew fiercer and he couldn't make it. The first time I was inside the castle was on April. April 8, 1945. The next time I managed to get inside was either on April 10th or April 11th. I can't remember clearly. By that time, the castle was on fire. The glass in the windows that you could see on that picture had shattered by then because of the heat. The fate of the Amber Room was a mystery for decades. Some researchers say it could have been destroyed by the heavy Allied bombing in 1945. Others presume the amber panels were taken aboard a German submarine, which was later sunk. The latest theory is that room is hidden in a bunker somewhere in Germany. We'll just have to wait and see if one of the greatest puzzles of the 20th century will finally be solved. Irina Galushko, Russia Today.